Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and a viewer or subscriber sent me this email of this uh, right here, and it's, it's a JPEG, so he was wanting to join these two lines, so just uh, need to let him know that he needs to turn it into a vector, trace it, but I'm not going to make a video about tracing because there's plenty of videos about tracing, but he wanted to join these two lines and have it just intersect with this is what I'm understanding. So the best way I know how to do it would be to just take your your item and left click and right click. And so I'm left click no fill and right click outline and I use hairlines. And then just take your shape tool and you can do it a number of ways but just move it with the mouse trying to watch your line on the left to make sure you're not getting off too far and then try to get see I moved that one but if he wanted them join you're gonna to have to do something in the middle so they're gonna be a little bit off the shape but that didn't look half bad now what I would do in this scenario would be to take my virtual segment delete key and delete these lines we don't know, do not need Matter of fact, you could delete that line and that line, and then take your Smart Fill tool, and also you would make sure you didn't have a leak. And now those two lines are joined. And then just left click, no outline. Well, when I was using the Smart Fill tool, I was putting an outline there. No, I wasn't. So the outline is still there. So what you could do is just cursor down and move that, that new item out of the way. You're, so you're still lined. And I don't know if he's playing. I guess he's going to join all the, or wanted to join all these lines. So that's what you could do is just do exactly what I did. And, you know, just kind of look at it and make sure it looks straight. And this is a kind of unique graphic because there's some curved lines and some straight lines. But anyway, I hope that helped him a little bit, and thank you for watching.